Kim Jong-un is the current leader of North Korea. Born on 8 January 1983, has been the supreme leader since 2011. Such is the political situation of North Korea that no news or information is shared with the world, hence any news or information is either leaked from various hidden sources or is a speculation based on known information. According to political, economical, cultural, military and journalistic analysis, Kim Jong-un has passed away. Daily NK, an online newspaper based in South Korea that focuses on North Korea, reports that Kim Jong-un reportedly received a cardiovascular system procedure recently. Kim Jong-un received the cardiovascular system procedure because of excessive smoking, obesity, and overwork, and is now receiving treatment in a villa in Hyangsan County following his procedure. According to CNN, the U.S. is monitoring intelligence that suggests North Korea's leader, Kim Jong-un, is in grave danger after undergoing a previous surgery. North Korea tightly controls any information surrounding its leader, who is treated almost like a deity within the country. His absences from official state media often spark speculations and rumors about his health. North Korea has no free press and is often a black hole when it comes to the country's leadership. Analysts are heavily reliant on scanning state media dispatches and watching propaganda videos for any semblance of a clue. Kim Jong-un last appeared in North Korean state media on April 11. April 15 is North Korea's most important holiday, the anniversary and the birthday of the country's founding father, Kim Il-sung. On that day, there was no official mention of Kim Jong-un visiting Joom's Mountain Palace, celebrating festivities of his grandfather. Experts are unsure of what to make of Kim's absence from any festivities celebrating his grandfather. When North Korean leaders have not shown up to these important celebrations in the past, it had portended major developments, this was the most important event that he should have appreared, unless he is dead. According to Korean culture, they are the most diligent people in the world, they feel guilty unless they work all the time. Since Kim Jong-un was very close to his grandfather Kim Il-sung, and in the past, never had missed attending celebration on 15th April, there are many speculations whether he is alive or not, especially when it is confirmed that after the heart surgery, his life was in grave danger. For a moment, let's consider that the speculations are correct, and Kim Jong-un has succumbed to death, then there's a lot of questions that arises. Number 1. What will happen to North Korea? Number 2. Will North Korea and South Korea finally be together and considered as a single country, Korea? Number 3. Who will be the next supreme leader of North Korea after Kim Jong-un? Kim Yo-jong, Kim Jong-un's younger sister. She is rumored to be the brains behind Kim Jong-un's carefully constructed public image at home and abroad. In return, she enjoys the absolute confidence of her brother, a leader capable of ordering the execution of his own uncle for alleged treason. Last month, she made her first public statement, condemning the South Korea as a frightened dog barking, after Seoul protested against a live-fire military exercise by the North Korea. She has not escaped the attention of U.S. officials as well, who in 2017 placed her and other North Korean officials on a blacklist for severe human rights abuses. Kim Yo-jong, she will become the next supreme leader after Kim Jong-un. North Korea will try to conceal the fact that Kim Jong-un has already passed away, and Kim Yo-jong, his younger sister, 
will announce that Kim Jong-un is receiving medical treatment at the hospital and eventually will take control as the post of supreme leader of North Korea. Under her reign, the situation will also be the same as under Kim Jong-un, if not worse. She too will follow the path of her brother, Kim Jong-un, as Kim Jong-un followed his father, Kim Jong-il.